What is going on everyone? It is Dinosaur Dale coming at you with some more GTA 5. Why? Because GTA 5 is amazing and unbelievable. That is a screenshot for the thumbnail. Anyways, I have no idea what we're going to be doing today. Uh, we might start with... Um, I don't know. There's a lot of people in this lobby. Really sucks. Uh, low times for this game is absolutely stupid uh, I forgot to show you guys in the last video we did kind of a tour of what was in the casino and I really didn't show you the penthouse uh, we're gonna exit to the roof um, I don't think yeah we got the uh, we got all this uh, this people can actually like come over here and hang out and stuff um also i love my jacket uh it's pretty amazing it makes me feel like i can float uh we get a lot of phone calls uh that's a lady in the bikini but this is actually really cool um because you can actually go over here uh Let's go over to this one. Uh, actually, there's someone in there. Okay. I don't know if she has a top on. Looks like she doesn't. Uh, all right. All right. So for, <laughs> cause some, I know there's. Uh, uh never mind. Okay. Uh, cause GTA does that sometimes. Uh, it's just, you know kind of ridiculous to to be honest uh like at the playboy mansion there's one without a top but you didn't hear it from me oh the, you can actually go down here i forgot about that oh this looks like a fire oh i didn't even realize this this is a i didn't realize this was a thing what's up guy how you doing yo this is amazing all right nice uh so we have our car over here, I believe. Oh my gosh! Well, let's just act like I planned that because I did. <laughs> Only reason I... Why did, why did it put me so far away? Ouch! And I... Yep, yeah, that's, that's why you use crosswalks, people. Because... Uh, do I not have my car here? What the crap? I'm gonna call a mechanic. Yo, home dog, my mechanic, where you at with my car, buddy? Uh, so, I'm gonna probably show you a little bit of my cars. Uh, I don't have many. Uh, I tend to buy cars, pimp them out, sell them. Uh, and it's really stupid because I put a lot of money into the cars. And it feels like, you know... Like, you shouldn't sell stuff if you're going to get half the price back. Uh, let's go over here. Let me jump over here. So, I actually bought this car the other day. I used to have it before. Uh, it's called the Chameleon. Hijack Chameleon, I think. Whoa, that is cool. Uh, I just made it all white. Uh, this is actually the first car in a long time that I put the neon kit on. Uh... I don't know, I felt like it needed it. And it's uh, mint green. Feels amazing. Uh, if you guys want to look, uh, you guys probably know all this, but to those who don't, it is under Legendary Motorsports. Uh, sort by price because it is very, very cheap. Um, I just feel like I need to. It's right here. Uh, I got it in white, like I said. It, it is an electric car, I think. I believe that's what it sounds like. Uh, most of it is upgraded besides the brakes. Uh, it is ex super expensive to upgrade cars in this game. Some cars. Um, but it is fairly fast. Uh, and, uh, you know, kind of turns on a dime. Drifting? Eh, could be a little bit better. Uh, you do stay on the road. You don't... Actually, it's not really bad. Like, you, you don't roll as much. Uh, I need to kick it in reverse. I've, I missed her turn. We gotta go this way. Down one. Down two. Uh, yeah, down one more. 
I know where I live. Do you guys? Uh, yeah. But as you can see, it doesn't really roll that much. Oh, Nelly. Yo, that was, pretty, that was pretty, like, Fast and Furious type shit right there. Not really a drifting car, because I did hit the e-brake right there. Um, I didn't, like, hammer it, but... Ooh, okay. So as you guys know, and as you guys can see, I'm a professional driver. I don't know if you guys know that about me. But, you know, in GTA, it's just a thing that happens. Um, this is probably one of my more sleeker cars. Uh, this is, this is all I got. This is all I got. Um, we got a $10,000 bike. We got an Elegi that is not even upgraded at all. Uh, I did change the paint color, uh, as you can see the hood. So, therefore, that is all I changed on it. Uh, it doesn't have anything. Uh, which, which I probably won't put any money into it because, one, it is a free car. And, two, because... Everyone has it probably somewhere in their garages uh, And if they don't I feel like this is the fastest free car uh, Next in line to the fastest free car would probably be the Duke of Death. This is like my uh, war machine Because if I remember correctly you can take three rockets three explosives uh, And it won't blow up uh, until like the third one. I think but this is my Duke of Death it is, I, th I want to say, I think I did paint it white. Um, then we got over here the F260, uh, I want to say. Tony, quit calling me. You're annoying, and I don't like you. Uh, I'm waiting for this thing to go away so I can see what it is. F620, Ocelot. Uh, this is not a bad coupe. Um, I actually really like it. I like the front of it, uh, as you can see, I'm going first person, and the front of it, it's not a bad car, uh, let me go back out in third person, um, the acceleration is amazing, um, let me get rid of that, uh, uh, oh my gosh, sometimes you hit it too many times, you, you're pretty much screwed after that, uh, I made it silver with the tires white, um, this is, I'm probably gonna make it white eventually. Uh, I do like the white in this game, but I do like how on the Olegi, LG, however you want to freaking say it, I don't give two Fs. Uh, you, I like that tint of blue. It looks amazing. But these are all my cars, sadly. Uh, I used to have more. I had the Futo with the uh, Princess Robot Bubblegum, I think. Yeah. I had that library on it. Um... Maybe one day I might customize or bring this to Benny's just to see what we can do. Uh, I really don't have the money for that though, like to be completely honest. Um, the coupe, if you're looking, f I don't remember, how much is this? Uh, I don't even know if you can, I, I think I found it on the street. Uh, I would assume it would be under Legendary Motorsports. Um... No, that's, uh, that's not it. No, no. I don't... I think you have to find it on the street. Unless... Can I sort this by... No, it's only by price. Uh, what about... Uh, is it in this? Filter list? Uh, luxury? It's not a luxury, is it? Uh, no. Um, hmm, exclusive stock, is this, is this where it would be? I don't, like I said, I think I picked it up off the street, because I, I doubt I would pay for it, because it's a coupe, but it seems like a really good coupe for me, so, you know, um, the body roll isn't as much, uh, it actually sticks to the ground pretty good. Yeah, no, it sticks to the ground a lot better than, uh, I think, I don't know. I, I don't know if I can say that. It's, it's, uh, if, if, if you go too much body, like, if you go, I'm making bad decisions here, people. Oh, yeah. 
Uh, it actually does have a lot more body roll than the Chameleon. Uh, but to be expected because the Chameleon is a sports car. And this is a coupe. As you can see in the bottom. Never mind. Actually, I know how to do this. Watch this. Uh, it is a coupe, I believe. I'm getting messages that I don't want. Um, they're super annoying. <sighs> yeah. Sometimes it'd be like that. Uh, this is fully maxed. Um, besides the body armor, I think, or the armor. But that's pretty much all my cars. Um, like I said, I used to have a lot more. Now, my favorite car that I want the most, and I know it's not the best performing, is the Zentorno. The Zentorno has always been a car I wanted. Um, I just have not really bought it because it is so expensive. Because the way I look at it, when I buy a car from like here, uh, I try to calculate how much it's going to take to upgrade uh, to a reliable amount of upgrades. So like sometimes you can go without body arm, uh, without armor. Sometimes you can go without turbo, and sometimes you can go without brakes and suspension and all that. But it all depends on the car. So, like, I try to calculate that in my mind because it's usually around fifty grand uh, to get the the best transmission for a car. Uh, the Pia, uh, Pifster Comet is not a bad car. I think I think I used to own that too. Um, the the banshee i think i owned i think it might have been this one one of the one of these banshees i used to own i used to own the hot knife because it was super cheap um some of these super cheap cars are actually really good um my cousin has this and his looks sick uh the way he customized it was amazing um i remember getting this car right here the coil voltic topless uh it might have not have, it might have been the coil voltic uh one of the two and i also had the vapid bullet vapid bullet is not bad uh and i used to have this car the vaca i think i got rid of it uh but that just goes to show and i also had this one right here the rustin but that just goes to show like i even my cousin said he does it too so like, we buy cars, and then we end up selling because we need the cash. And, like, in GTA 5, they, they just want you to microtransaction everything. Um, all these businesses, it takes a long time to make, like, a decent amount of money to even buy a $700,000 car, dollar car. And it's just frustrating to me. But, I mean, it is what it is. Like, I sold... Uh, I sold out my uh, small storage for the CEO business stuff. I only got two hundred and four thousand. Like that's not much, if you think about it. Like you can't even really truly upgrade a car with that much money. Um, if you include all the neon lights and all that stuff, the and the other headlights and. You know the paint cars or uh, the paint that you actually want because some of these pearlescents like yeah they look amazing but they're super expensive um but that's just my rant on the game uh, i feel like they could have done a little bit better job of having you be able to make money okay yeah that's where that's where the brakes would have came in but i like i said i didn't upgrade this to the max I'm just going to show you real quick before we end this episode. Uh, I just really wanted to show you my cars. Uh, why did I answer that? I don't know. I shouldn't have. And see, I would be like... Sometimes they do uh, double XP and double money for stunt races. I would do like six laps solo just to try to make money. And it was, it was really bad. Uh, breaks is 35,000. That is ridiculous. Uh, that is upgraded to completion. This is the one I want. Um, so like, 
just the brakes alone, thirty-five thousand. Okay. Then all this other stuff that you got, uh, the respray paints can get expensive. Uh, if you want like super light colors. Yeah, see, it's not even worth to sell anymore. And I'm not gonna sell it anymore, cause I I just don't believe in that anymore. Like now I'm buying cars for beauty. Um. But yeah, that is a uh, that is that that's gonna be the end of this video. If you guys did enjoy, hit that like button, comment, subscribe, share, hit that post notification bell, cause it really does help. And my channel is dying. But you know what? It is what it is. Um. It's not in my hands anymore, uh, the way, I don't know, the way I look at it now. So, uh, and if you guys go back to, uh, the real talk video that I did with Minecraft, you'll understand why. Um, but, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys, oh, shiza, I was trying to do an outro, and I will see you guys next time.